Previously on Lana Steel. Find my butler, and he will tell you all I have instructed. Hey, handsome. Nice to meet you too, I'm Raymond. I know. All I can say is, a picture is worth a thousand words. Love does not dwell in evil. It rejoices in trust. It always protects, it's always truthful, and it always perseveres. Do you, Raymond Carter, take this woman as your wife, forsaking all others until death do you part? I do. With the powers vested in me by the state of California, I now pronounce you man and wife. You can kiss the bride now. This is not how I expected to spend my Saturday. But at least I'm rocking the perfect bridal look. The key is keeping it soft and simple. Ready, boss. Eyeshadow. Got it. Using a light brown eyeshadow, like rice paper from MAC, I blended color onto my entire lid. Then followed it up with all that glitters in the crease. A soft pink in the crease adds definition without looking heavy. Cheek contour. You got it. Using an uplifting motion, I added a rosy color from Clinique's Cheek Contour Palette to the apples of my cheeks. Every bride wants to look like she's blushing. Lip gloss. Roger that. Boom. Lips should always be last to help give my perfect pout a longer wear time. MAC Lip Gloss completed my look. Thank you, Quinn. And done. Oh, Lana! Don't do that. Last but not least, gun. Everybody... Decent? Hey, you can't come out here. It's bad luck to see the bride before the wedding. In that case, feast your eyes. Uh, Quinn, we only need to act like it's a ceremony during the actual wedding. How do we even know Heartbreaker's gonna show up? Well, every venue in the area has been shut down. And you intel on the butler? No. He surrendered way too easily. Look, I know you would rather chase clues to uh, unravel the mystery of Mr. X, but we have a killer targeting weddings, killing the groom in the middle of the ceremony, and she needs to be stopped. So we'll pose as the perfect targets, and when she shows... And what if she doesn't show? Would you guys still go through with the ceremony and actually get married? <laughs> uh, I don't even think we're going to get like, that far. And there's like, you know, annulments right, for stuff yeah, like that. Right. Quick so. survey, do you guys think it's appropriate to French kiss at weddings? Um... Yeah. Uh, no, 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 um, no, no, no. Oh! Look at the time. I am... I have to go talk to the official. Because he was calling official. you. Right, okay, yeah. he's coming. So, uh... Good luck, troops. Kiss him? It takes all my energy not to kill Raymond. Heartbreaker's gonna show up. I just know it. You can kiss the bride. Get down! She's getting away! Not today. Lana! Where'd she go? Right here. You don't know what it's like being left at the altar? Let him go, Heartbreaker. To lose the person you wanted to spend the rest of your life with. <laughs> but you will. Say goodbye. You know what? You're right. Men do suck. Ah! No! 
Nice shooting. I just got one idiot. Big complaint. You'll live. Quinn, send a medic. Roger that. FYI, I'm keeping the ring. Does that mean we're going to study? I'm just gonna assume that's the blood loss talking. Mm. Lana? Yeah? Let's not do this again. Deal. Ugh. Not my ideal Saturday. But then again, it was better than Raymond's. What up everyone, it's your girl, Superwoman, and congratulations for witnessing the only marriage I will ever have. And you saw it first here, in a movie. Speaking of movies, check out this awesome series called That Movie Look, and I will see you next Friday for another episode of Lana Steele, Makeup Spy. One love, Superwoman, that is a wrap, and zoop!